What's going on YouTube? So we're gonna switch it up a little bit today and we're gonna talk about the most underrated cartoon of all time. This cartoon doesn't get anywhere near the appreciation that it deserves. And if you're a big fan of Boy Meets World or Girl Meets World or just cartoons that actually have a meaning, that actually have a purpose, and it's not just there to be there, this is the cartoon you're looking for. And you know I didn't really appreciate this cartoon like I should have as a kid, but now that I'm older I know why. And that's because this cartoon isn't really meant for kids. Now that doesn't mean kids can't watch it, but this cartoon is more for the mature crowd. You know, the upper teens and adults. And just like Girl Meets World, this show is all about life lessons. And it's just so completely relatable. And it's so realistic. Which is probably one of the main reasons I love it so much. Now a lot of people say that this is like the girl version of Doug. And I can kind of see why they say that. But you know, I've never been the big Doug fan either. I did kind of like it as a kid, but it was never one of like my favorite shows. And I wonder if that's the same reason why. Because I was too young to really appreciate it. Maybe I should watch Doug over one day soon. But I digress. This cartoon has everything. It has realistic moments and scenarios. It has friendship and betrayal. It has characters that you really like and characters that you can't stand. If you're really big Big on ships like you guys know I am, this show definitely has couples that you can get behind and root for. I know that there's one couple in particular on this show that makes me feel all kinds of ways. Now, I don't want to spoil anything for you guys that haven't watched the show and may plan on watching it in the future, but there is a couple of songs on this show that no matter how many times I watch it, I still get overly emotional. And if you guys follow me on Instagram, you already know know what I'm talking about. There were copper colored ponies, there was air that smelled like rain, and the moon was out in daytime when I first learned your name. But I'm probably going to make at least one or two other videos talking about this show in the future because you know I really feel like it deserves it. And had YouTube been a thing when this show was out, and had I had a YouTube channel, my channel probably would have been dedicated to this cartoon the same way it is Girl Meets World right now. That's how much I love this cartoon. But you know I really can't say much else without spoiling things, so I guess maybe I'll save the spoilers for another video. But let me know if you guys have ever watched this cartoon, and if you haven't, I'm telling you guys you really should, because I really do think you'll like it. I can't think of a better cartoon that's more underrated than this. One of my favorite cartoons of all time, if not my favorite cartoon of all time. But you guys go ahead and give it a watch, and let me know what you think. But I'm done talking. So as always, until next time. Yeah.